not necessarily religious. I would say that I'm spiritual. I have had a handful of moments in my life where, I don't know, you just kind of feel like you're a part of something bigger than yourself, you know? Like there's a bigger picture of something that you're not really quite aware of, but like you're still somehow connected to it. That day I woke up and I just had this burning itch in my mind about trying Indian food. I was Googling stuff, I was looking at videos. I looked up tons of local restaurants and just was deep diving into the menu. There were so many things on there that I didn't know what it was. So of course I had to copy and paste and then go to Google and try to look and figure out what it is. And you guys were so nice in the comment section, helping me understand how to pronounce it, what the difference is between the Pani versus the Pori. I felt such a sense of joy and just just like I was a part of something that was just so meaningful. And then I saw this word quite a few times in the comments. And I was like, what is that? I don't know what that is. So I Googled it and I am just mind blown that I have never heard of this. Of course, because I'm insanely curious by nature, I spent another entire day sitting on my phone learning all about Diwali. The most important holidays to India and surrounding countries, also called the Festival of Lights. Picture our Thanksgiving and Christmas, but like times 10. I forgot to say what I'm making also. I am making jalebi. That was water, sugar, this is cardamom. They light thousands of these little clay oil lamps all around the city, all throughout their home. This is supposed to help Lakshmi find her way into their homes to bring prosperity, to bring wealth throughout the next year. Now I'm gonna add in a little saffron. This was expensive, y'all. It's a time to clean your home. It's a time to get dressed up and celebrate food and family and celebrating good, conquering evil. A lot of people start this five day long holiday out by going shopping. Day three is the main Diwali day where you are are praying to Lakshmi for wealth and prosperity throughout the year and lots and lots of food. I'm gonna add a dash of flake salt. Let me know in the comments other ways to make this. There's many different ways that Diwali is celebrated but however you celebrate it, have a good time. Mmm, eat delicious food. Mmm. Oh my God. Enjoy your family, enjoy your friends. How many of these do you normally eat in one sitting? Because these are dangerous.